name is Lena and I'll be playing Baraccio. Hi, I'm Arlene and I'll be playing Don John. Hello, I'm Jesus and I'll be playing Conrad. My lord, why are you so sad? Because everything makes me sad and I'm always sad. If you would only just listen to me, the voice of reason, then you wouldn't be so sad. And what would I ever gain with doing that? Well, if it won't stop your sorrows, then it'll give you patience to deal with them. Oh, coming from a man like you, what good would that ever bring me? You are such a moody man. You are no man of your word. I am a living prisoner in my brother's prison. <coughs> I live when I am told to. I laugh when I am told to. I eat when I am told to. <coughs> I have no freedom. My lord, but can't you turn these grievances <coughs> into... Your own advantage? <laughs> no, I cannot. I hate my brother with all my heart. If I had any chance to, I would murder him with my own bare hands. My lord, I have just overheard some juicy gossip. And what is it that you have heard, Baraccio? Tis... Tis... Get on with it! This is why I have had you here in my service. You are worthless without doing so. Your... Your brother. Your brother's right-hand man. The pretty boy, Claudio. What about this man that has slaughtered my honor in war? He is to be married, and to Leonardo's daughter, Hero. Oh, and when and where <laughs> did you hear of this? I was hiding when I overheard them, and I stayed to listen in. Oh, is this true? Yes. So what if we make a rumor saying that the dearest Hero is a whore, a common sale, and have you in her room having a role play with, with Margaret. Hmm. This is a good plan. And you will be at her window making love to Margaret, calling her by the name of the dearest hero. And then I will have the prince and Sir Claudio <laughs> to make the two men believe that who Claudio will be marrying is a slut. The common sale. Yes. Are you all with me? Yes, of course. Till our death. Let us go then. I go first. <laughs> <laughs>